Ladies and gentlemen, have you ever seen the show where the masked magician puts on that mask and he teaches all the tricks to you? Mm -hmm. That was me. <laughs> I needed the money. So what I'm going to do tonight is I'm going to tell you all the secrets in card magic. I'll tell you how everything happens, okay? See, magicians cheat. I'll show you what I mean. Look, at here. here's what they do. First of all, most card tricks are what they call pick-a-card tricks. Here's how most of them work. Here's how sneaky they are. And it kind of it pisses me off just thinking about it, okay? <laughs> but what they do is they usually fan out the cards and they say, pick a card. But when the person goes to pick, <laughs> what they do is they have the cards face up so they know what the card is. And they cheat. Uh -huh. See what I mean? But you don't realize that because you're, like, heavily influenced under whatever it is that maybe you took. Okay? <laughs> okay. So another way that a magician would have you pick a card is to go like this. But, again, he could just look over the top of the pack and be able to see in there. And it's, it's kind of bullshit is what it is. Okay? <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a card picked in the most fairest possible way. Do me a favor. What is your name, please? Rachel. That's my middle name. Wow, this is awesome. <laughs> Tell you what, Rachel, Rachel, Rachel. Is it Rachel or Rachel? Rachel. Okay, Rachel, here's what we're going to do. I will go like this, and whenever you want, just say stop. Stop. I thought you were never going to say stop, Rachel. Okay, ten of dimes. Is that okay, or shall I go on? No, that's fine. Sure? sure? It doesn't matter. I'm getting paid big bucks. I'm paying pay, pay by the hour. That's, <laughs> Ten of diamonds is great. That's good. I would have picked that one, too. Now, in other tricks, what magicians do is they have two cards chosen in a fair possible way. So what I would like you to do, tough guy, would you take that snapper head and <laughs> just, I, what I'd like you to do is just place it in between any two cards of your choice, any two. So, there we go. Perfect. Nobody's ever done it that well. Look at what he did. He placed that card in between the four and the five. Now, you have to admit, that's a fair way to have cards chosen, right? Okay? Now, that's just the beginning of what magicians do. The next thing they do is they mark the cards. For example, the cards are marked down here on the back. Different color inks, dark blue, light blue, will tell you what the card is. Let me explain. We have a ten of diamonds, five of diamonds, four of diamonds, and the three of spades. All four of these cards are marked. Now, here's how you read them. Diamonds are always marked in the corner back here. You just look down in the lower left corner. You could probably see that. Okay? That's where the diamonds are marked. Tens of higher cards are marked up on top. All these cards are marked, the three and the four. Now, when magicians mark the cards, they always mark the cards in blue ink, okay? I, of course, prefer the red ink. <laughs> and really, no, 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 it's not much of a trick unless that card is marked, that card is marked, that card is marked, and that's the trick. Thank you very much. Yes!